Some teenagers are back home after a world fencing championship thousands of miles away. How about this? The fencing club from Troy went all the way to Saudi Arabia to show off their skills. Victor Williams is live with more on what they accomplished and the warm welcome they got upon returning to Detroit Metro Airport, Victor. <laughs> Oh, yeah, Kimberly and Damon. You know, we were right there almost when these guys got off the plane. The family members were right there also, and you would have thought that they had just won the Super Bowl. It's the warmest of welcomes for a team coming back from the Middle East. You know, we went all the way to Saudi Arabia. We had some training camps, but we didn't know what to expect. And they came in second, fifth, and fifth. Several 16-year-olds made the trip from Michigan to Saudi Arabia with 20 hours of travel each way. Adeline Scenic placed fifth. Really amazing, and I'm just so thankful I've been able to come this far. I was really nervous at first. I had never been to a World Championships before. So starting off, I was pretty nervous, but I don't know, the energy just continued to grow, and after the first round, I was feeling really confident. Jada's Deserano placed second. It's been a uh, journey trying to qualify, because uh, the U.S. is one of the most competitive countries in the world for fencing, and I've been coming up just short for the past couple of years, and this year I was finally able to uh, go to World Championships and bring home a medal is uh, absolutely amazing. Perhaps the reason why they did so well is because of the guidance they had from coaches Anatoly Scenic and Anne Marsh Scenic, Adeline's parents. This guy has coached them since they were eight years old. The whole time, this was our goal, and so I think that they did a great job. And I hope our uh, U.S. team you know, lead the count, medal count, and we're going to end up the first. Now, Luau Yang was another young man that went to Saudi Arabia, did pretty well and came back, but they ended up on a later flight, so we weren't able to catch them. Either way, we are very proud of everyone that came back from Saudi Arabia. Victor mm. Williams. Congratulations to them. All right, great story. Thanks, Victor.